Hello and welcome friends. Welcome back to my channel Artistry Videos. So in today's topic, I'm going to show you how can I recover my AutoCAD file. So see here, in this video, I'm going to show you the three methods to recover your AutoCAD files. Now say, take a look. In first method, I'm going to show you how to recover your AutoCAD file by using backups. So generally, backup file is the same name suggested as for your backup file of your AutoCAD. So it is automatically generated in your backend by AutoCAD software. So take a look. Now see here, this is my AutoCAD file. Say I generated some elements and then I saved in my path. So I'm going to show you this path. See here, this is my path where I saved this test drawing file, right? Now see here, I'm going to close this file. I'm going to save this file and then I'm going to close this file, right? So see here, in this, here it is generated your backup file. Say this is the file name and this is a .bak extension, right? So accidentally, I close this original AutoCAD file like this. Say I'm going to delete this file permanently. Say yes. Now see here, by using this backup file, I can recover my AutoCAD file. What you want to do is simply you need to change its extension .bak into AutoCAD. Change this, say .dwg, hit enter. So here it will ask you some uh, notification. Do you want to change, uh, change this extension? Say yes, I'm going to change this extension. Now I'm going to open this file. So see here, it will show your AutoCAD file. So like that you can restore your AutoCAD file by using backup files. So this is your one of the methods. Now another method to restore your AutoCAD file by using temporary files. So before that I am going to show you one setting. The setting is go to your option menu say click on this AutoCAD application. Go to this option and here you have one dialog box. So in this dialog box you will have this option open and save. So see here by default you will have this automatic save option into 10 minutes see here like this now i need to change into one minute so uh, i'm going to reduce my uh, automatic saving time into one minute now where that temporary file will be saved so go to this file now here you will have this option say automatic save file location so i'm going to click here and then see here this is my part i'm going to copy this part right so keep in, be remember that, go to this menu, reduce this uh, time minute for your automatic save, hit apply, okay. Now another method to set your automatic saving time, the command is save time, hit enter. Now see here, I have already saved my time for a one minute. If you save a five minute like this here, hit enter so automatically it will save here again it will update here also go to this option menu hit op enter and say here so like that you can change from here also so automatic save hit enter one hit apply hit ok now see here i'm going to add or i'm going to modify some of my elements of my autocad objects right so i'm going to change these properties like this So see here, means what I have made some changes, I have modified my objects. If you make some changes and you will, you left your uh, PC or computer for a minute while. So it will show you a pop up here. It will indicate that your AutoCAD file will be saved in XXYY uh, path naming as so and so. So we'll wait for a minute. So see here, after a minute, this file has been saved in this path so i'm going to use this file so already have copied this path so see here this is my uh, file i want which i want to use it so i'm going to copy this file and i will paste here now see here 
this extension of your temporary file has been saved as .sv$. You need to rename this extension into .dwg. Hit enter and see here. See, I am going to close this file, my uh, earlier file. Now I need to open this uh, temporary file which has renamed it. Now see here. You can also record your file by using temporary files of your AutoCAD. Now third solution is see here. Sometimes what happened? Your uh, while you working with your AutoCAD, so sometimes your uh, AutoCAD might get crashed, right? Now what is Drawing Recovery Manager? I will open that command. Say command is say Drawing Recovery Manager. Drawing Recovery. Hit enter. In here, accidentally whichever your file is crashed. Automatically it will show you here like this your file name will be continuing with your recovery name Right, so you need to save that file and you can save as it for your further continuation Or you can record your file by using these three methods so like that you can record your AutoCAD file So I hope I have shown you some important point to record your AutoCAD file so Thanks for watching guys. Bye. Bye. Have a nice day